So this is a quick video on how to identify the main jets in a Weber DCOE 45. First off, we we'll remove the inspection cover. Then as you can see, we have the two main jets, then the two idle jets. So if we remove the main jet first, with the pair of pliers we can just slide this end bit off. and then that exposes the air corrector on the end which is a 185 they just slide out again with a pair of pliers so he says and I don't know whether that's picking up but a 185 air corrector so that just slides back in there nicely then in the middle we have the emulsion tube which mine is an F16 I don't know whether that's picking that up so an F16 emulsion tube I need to write that one down Then at the very bottom is the main jet, which mine is a 145. Again, just slide out. So that's a main jet assembler. So now the idle jet. Again, the end just slides off. Now my idle jet is a F955. So that's the idle jet. Also, you do have pump jets, which are located here. One, two. Again, screw that off. And then with a pair of pliers or even your fingers you can get this one. And that's your pump jet. Which mine is a 45. Also while we're at it, we can check the choke size. Because I have the trumpets off. So if you just shine a torch inside there. I don't know whether the camera's picking that up, but you can see my choke is a 36. So there you go, thanks for watching.